Hi, how are you guys doing? So with the second episode of the second season of Nijigaku has passed, now it's time for us to go over the results for the poll where we had you guys rank the girls from 1 to 13 with 1 being your favorite and 13 being your least favorite. So with the conclusion of the second episode, let's see where these girls rank. So in 13th place, we have Yu Takasaki. We get, got caught in at 12. 11 goes to Ai. 10th place goes to Ayumu. 9th place goes to Shizuku. 8th place goes to Shiriko. 7th place goes to Mia, 6th place goes to Setsuna, 5th place goes to Ranju, 4th place goes to Kasumi, 3rd place goes to Emma, 2nd place goes to Rina, and 1st place goes to Kanata. So we got some interesting results, some stay the same, and some drastically changed. So let's go look at the overall results. This is accumulation of all the, the results. Again, as a reminder, red means the worst in each category, yellow means generally the best in each category. So let's start with last place again as Yu Takasaki. I don't really expect this to change unless you get some really special moment anime that hasn't happened. It might not happen soon. Who knows? But for right now, she's going to be 13th place and that's kind of automatic. Then we have 12th and 11th. That's Kata and I. Again, Diver Diva. These girls struggled. Wait for the Diver Diva episodes. That, of course, hasn't happened. We had the Quartz episode, so expect Quartz girls to get a little bit more love in this episode and, of course, the upcoming episode. But for right now, yeah, they did not do so well. Ayumu getting 10. She has kind of fallen off pretty hard recently. And again, with the anime, we still, the last major thing she kind of had was the Yanade moments. So that's, I guess, wait for Asuna episodes. We'll see if that somehow drastically changes people's opinions on her. But right now, yeah. Eh. She's going to fall a little bit off. She goes about where she has been. Then we have Mia, 7. Not too bad, honestly, for her. She hasn't really had any super special moments, I guess. She had interaction with the cat, and you got to see her come into the music class, but not much has happened yet, so we'll see if she's going to continue to move up or not. Setsuna has fallen off a bit. The six is not too bad, but notable that she usually was like top three. Fifth place goes to Anju. She's still doing pretty solid. Most people are kind of over the hate for her, especially with the direction that they're going with Anju in this anime versus the all-star story. So, looks like she's been grabbing a lot of attention to people's hearts, but we still see 13 votes for last place, so there's still a few people who are still not happy about her and her impact that she had on the group. And then we have Kasumi and Kanata, Emma, and Rina taking the top four. It's Lily Quartz. That wasn't very interesting to see. I, I know this episode was kind of about quartz, but dang, how did they literally sweep the top four? That was kind of interesting. Kind of going to first has not, and like it's happened before. She's usually been all right in the rankings. So that's not too bizarre to see, but she hasn't really had a whole lot of moments in the anime that would make me think that she deserved to have a huge jump. But, you know, I like Kanta, so that's fine. Rina has been popular for a lot of people, so her being second is, you know, pretty normal. Cosmic getting fourth, not too bizarre. Probably the most bizarre is definitely got to be Emma. Because, just like, she was towards the back end of the rankings consistently. And suddenly she just up, jumped third, so I, I see you guys. So, the reason why she jumped up so high is because she got a lot of first places and second places. So either A, you guys really enjoyed the few moments Emma had in here. I'm like, I guess she was a little bit more important in this episode. I don't think that's a good enough reason to jump her from, you know, almost last to almost first. But I see you guys. I think you guys came in and voted really hard for her. So she jumped really high quick. But we'll see if that stays or if, if that dies off. Because that's kind of how it usually happens. People will... For one time say yeah i'll give him a, a high ranking because why not and now drop off but seeing as the next episode should still be about quartz i still expect these girls to probably stay near the top and we'll have to see what song that happens and what major role these girls have so for right now i'm expecting quartz to still stay up here while the other girls will suffer a little bit because they're not quartz so now let's go ahead and take a look at the results from all the previous polls so I have added the before season 2 so you can see where they were before season 2 we got the two episodes now so you can start seeing a trend as you can see like for Emma she was dead last and so she's not isn't that crazy 
So that was definitely pretty interesting to see that. And we see Kanata, you know, she's actually won two of them. Rina's been doing consistently well. But you can see that these girls, yeah. The quartz is definitely done pretty good here. But this is just interesting to see the trends, it's especially, you know, once we get through more episodes, we can get a bigger idea of how these trends evolve and who has been the favorite overall. And, you know, some girls will definitely win more of their episodes that are focused on them. But we'll see, you know, overall throughout the whole, the whole season, who has been the favorite for these girls. As you can see right now, Yu Takasaki is definitely going to be struggling for a while. But Rina has been overall the favorite so far. But we'll see if that stays true. We have Kasumi and Kanata doing pretty well. And yeah, it's going to be a little more quartz heavy for right now. But we'll have to see how that changes in the future. Maybe Diver Diva will get some love in the future. Who knows? Helen and I definitely need some help. But beyond that, we have the demographics as normal. So if you're curious to see the demographics of the viewers, here they are. And of course, a big shout out to all the people who participated in this poll. Thank you very much. This is not possible without you guys. So uh, I really appreciate you guys giving out your opinions and explain why. Just because like, I'm curious to see how people opinions change on these girls over time. And of course, big shout out to YouTube members like Coolmax for supporting the channel. If you want to be on here, please consider support. Anyways, I have also have all the comments, literally all the comments. There wasn't a crazy amount, so I just decided I'll slap them on all of them on there. So if you wanted to read how people felt about that episode. But anyways, let me know what you guys thought about that episode and where do you think the direction of Quartz is going to be. I'm curious to see. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a new song, but I'm definitely looking forward to seeing that and what moments they have in there and how the normal girls will potentially be involved in that. But of course, then we'll eventually have all the other sim units involved as well. So I'm curious to see what you guys think about that and what do you think is going to happen in the next episode. Let me know about that in the comments below. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in another video soon.